got quick hands and he's throwing a lot of body shots. Last 60 seconds, Putayo now round later, round number 10. And you can see that he is bothered by the cut. Good left by Nietes. The busier fighter, Moises Puentes of Mexico. Very clearly. But the power punch is still with Donny. But I think that power is waning as this fight wears on, partner, because he's getting caught with so many punches. Good flurry of by Fuentes. Tignan po ninyo, sa bawat isang kanan ni Nietes, tatlong suntok ang kapalit mula kay Fuentes. Last 20 seconds. Looping right hand by Fuentes. Fuentes chasing Nietes. 10 seconds, final 10 seconds. Fuentes chasing Nietes. There goes the bell, end of round number 10. Time now for the Cobra Tuna in the Lakas punch of the round. <laughs> Fuentes digging deep with that right hand. Pero may ganting kanan si Donny Nietes. Pero yung problema ni Donny Nietes, isa lang, suntok niya. One punch at a time. That's not going to work against a guy who's throwing so many punches. Well, he did rock Fuentes early on. And uh, sabi natin, baka medyo nakumpiyansa at napiling niya eh. Makukuha yeah. ko sa isang malaking kanan. Oh. Pero papasok na po tayo sa ikalabing isang round 11. ng labang ito. Round number 11, Fuentes versus Nietes for the WBO Light Flyweight Championship. Nietes moving around, sneaking in with one punch. But he's got to throw a flurry of punches. One punch is not going to do it, uh, partner. Especially against a fighter like Fuentes, who's, who is very, very busy with both hands. He has to roll the dice, take a gamble. His title is on the line. Don't need it. Very much on the line, believe me. That in a winning streak. Of six years. Oh, oh. he's on the line. Good left by Nietes. Good uppercut by Nietes. Pero he doesn't follow up. Tignan mo. Yun nga ang kulang. Even yeah. parang si Puentes mismo nabibigyan. Natin ka. Good hard load. right. There's a left hand by Nietes. Stop. No punching. No punching. Yun ang problema niya. Makanda yung uh, uppercut. On the young right hand, but he doesn't follow up when, when Fuentes is hurt. He doesn't follow up. Fuentes still he's, barging in. Fuentes also is pretty tired, but he's not bloody. That's the difference. He throws a good right. Stop. 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 You know, that's not enough for him to win this fight, but I mean, he needs a knockout, I think. In my honest opinion, he needs a knockout to win. We are winding down to the last minute of, of the, round number 11. The penultimate round. Ryder Pyra has been seriously hurt, although Quinte has been rocked a little, but not to the extent that uh, the foot is obviously in good condition. He's got, continuing to come forward. And Marco Antonio Barrera shouting out here, telling him to go forward. And Nietes is backing off. That's not going to help him either. A right hand by Fuentes. Good combination by, by Nietes. 25 seconds remaining in round number 11. You know, you can get out of trouble, but unless you throw a punch and score, it's a hard time. Winding 
up the clock for this round. There goes the bell end of round 11. Time now for the Cobra Tunay na Lakas Punch of the Round. <laughs> ang big white uppercut na binitawan ni Nietzsche sa round number 11. Ba't yun nga, lumayo siya, walang follow up, samantalang open na open si Puentes. There's that big right uppercut and notice the lack of follow up. What a fight it has been. In the corner of... Uh... Fuentes telling him to jab, 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 keep him away. Twelfth and final round coming up. Jack Reese, the third man in the ring. And the crowd cheering on Donny, shouting Donny, Donny, trying to re-energize the champion. But if he backs off, Mahirapan is here. You've got to be the aggressor. Good right to right. And yet is egging on Fuentes to mix it up. But that won't happen. Nietes. Fuentes is a little too smart for that. This has been a long and grueling affair. A bloody affair, if I may say so. Yeah, that has been bloody both eyes, huh? Both, both eyes. Fuentes going forward. Nietes should know by now that this fight is, is on the line. He needs to do something spectacular in this final round to to try and salvage a victory. Good That's left and right by Nietes. This should be a very close fight. I wonder how the judges will score this if it goes to the score times. Adelaide Bird, Pat Russell, and Dan Rickstabdas and other judges. See, and he that. off balance. He didn't, didn't follow up. Too bad. Baka, uh, the body shots are the ones that have taken its toll on Donny Nietes. You know, problem niya. Maganda laban naman ito. Binigay siya todo, pero... You can never points. say. Depends on the judges. Just over a minute and 14 seconds to go in this 12th and final round. And Donny Nietes is, is, is moving around. That's not going to help his cause, I think. I don't know. I'm not a judge. It will be a tough fight to score. Do the judges Good appreciate left by the body punching? Nietes. Good left by Nietes. Looping left by Nietes. He's looking to take this round. And Pettis is egging on. Let's do it. Stop. Stop punching. Stop punching. Very tough fight to score. Certainly the busier fighter has been Moises Fuentes. Nietes connected with the bigger punches, no, no doubt about that. That drop. 20 seconds remaining in this fight. Hard right by Fuentes. Ten seconds left for Angel Alabi. It's gonna go to the scorecards. Good right hand. Nietes. Landing some good shots in the final round. He may just there steal this bell. round. End of the round. We'll see what the judges have to say. Time now for the Cobra Tunay na Lakas punch of the round. Ito po ang nangyari sa huling round, which... Nietes may have stolen, in, in my view, because uh, he landed the cleaner punches. Uh, referee Pat Russell came to me and said, excellent fight. Cebu City Hotel and Casino. Before we go to the scorecards, what a terrific fight. Let's have a round of applause for both fighters. After 12 rounds of exciting boxing, we go to the scorecards. Judge Dan Rex top Dawson scores about 115, 113 for Nietes. Judge 
Patrick Russell scores the bout. 114-114 even. And Judge Adelaide Bird scores the bout. 114-114. This bout is a majority draw. A majority But in my unofficial scorecard, I had it actually 114, 114, believe it or not. But on official scorecards, my baby guy, the 114, and Judge Dandrick of Planet had it 115, 130 in Vietnam, but that is not enough. So. Majority draw. I don't think Marco Antonio Barrera is very pleased. Yes. He's talking to Leon Pononcillo and Jorge uh, Barrera also went forward and pointed the finger, but Marco Let's shoot him away. Applause for the challenger. What a grueling card, mga kaibigan. Sa ating naging unang laban, Genesis Cervania, na natiling WBO Asia Pacific Super Bantamweight Champion, via a TKO in the seventh round contra kay Anki Angkota. Don't clear cut. Maganda laban yan. Pero Anki Angkota's face was bloodied. I think he broke his nose. So referee Tony Pesons decided time to stop the fight. And in our main event, mga kaibigan, sa maniwala kahit hindi, naging tabla po ang desisyon sa labang Nietes versus Puentes. At dahil po majority draw, nananatiling WBO light flyweight champion si Tony Ahas Nietes. Magandang laban. Sabi ni Pat Russell, he came to me after the fight and said, that was a really exciting fight. It was exciting fight. Watch it. Make up your own mind who you think won that fight. Pero mga kaibigan, marami pa kaming bakbakan sa susunod na edisyon ng Pinoy Pride. So umantabay lamang po kayo. Sa nga lang po ng ABS-CBN Sports at Ala Boxing Promotions, ako po si Ed Tolentino, kasama si Ronnie Nathaniel, nagsasabing, kabayan, hanggang sa susunod na bakbakan. <laughs>